Amid falling infection rates and low COVID-19 hospitalizations, state health officials say they feel confident in reopening the entire state of California on June 15th. This comes as the state meets its goal of 4 million vaccine doses administered in disadvantaged communities, now allowing Riverside County to move into the orange tier of reopening with relaxed restrictions starting tomorrow. News Channel 3's Taban Sharifi is live in Palm Desert with more on what that means. Taban. Thank you, John Karen. Right now I'm live in Palm Desert on El Paseo where many businesses here will be able to operate under lesser restrictions as we move into the orange tier tomorrow. Plus, we're taking a look ahead to when we can just get rid of the entire color tier system altogether. 16 counties are moving today into less restrictive tiers. One of those counties being Riverside County moving into the orange moderate tier effective Wednesday. It's not done soon enough, in my opinion, and I'm very glad that things are opening up. A big change in this tier comes with the operation of bars. They'll now be able to operate outdoors for the first time since June of 2020. Just the fact that everything's opening up and people are able to get out, and uh, that's a good thing. Restaurants and churches will now be able to operate at 50% capacity indoors. I think it's uh, encouraging. And I think we need encouragement right now. I really look forward to going back to the gym. Gyms, wineries and breweries moving to 25% capacity indoors. Please continue to be safe as you're going to more places in the community. Continue to wear your mask and patronize those businesses that are taking the safeguard seriously. Governor Gavin Newsom in a press conference Tuesday expressed California has the lowest case and positivity rate in the U.S. If we keep the pace. We are moving now beyond the blueprint. The governor also announcing when we will be getting rid of the colored tier system altogether. We can confidently say by June 15th that we can start to open up as business as usual. Subject to ongoing mask wearing and ongoing vigilance. As for when we could see a move to the yellow tier. We have to stay in the orange tier for a minimum of three weeks. And then we will need to meet the yellow tiers metrics for two of those weeks. And with many things reopening, still concerts, live theaters and festivals will remain closed under the orange tier. For a complete list of the changes the Coachella Valley can see under this tier, visit KESQ.com. Live in Palm Desert, Taban Sharifi, News Channel 3.